lost again going back around Dreaming of a time when I get things right Hi everyone and welcome back to another lost vlog in the shadows Today is Monday, October 15th Very dreary day here in Ohio and I've got some errands to run. It is Monday and I am on the go. Uh, I'm gonna pick up some ribbon because we're gonna start actually planning some Christmas decor, yes. But I'm gonna get ahead of the game, so not yet. <laughs> but I'm gonna go get some ribbon from Sam's Club. Um, where else do I have to run to? Anyway, I have a list on my desk. So it's gonna be dreary. I'm gonna try to vlog as much as I can. I'm gonna get my rain boots on and my jacket and head out. All right, I'm outside of Sam's Club and I'm gonna get some, like I said, some ribbon. I've been on a hunt for a 2019, like a day planner. What's up with this big thing? Day planner like I had last year and I got it at Target. And all I have is like the academic ones, the 1819, I don't, I don't want that. I mean, obviously, you know, it's only a couple more months left of 2018. So I'm gonna try our Home Depot, oh, Office Depot, I mean. I'm so excited that our staple's close. So I'm gonna go run in, get some ribbon, and then I'm gonna hunt for a new planner because I really loved my planner that I currently have. So let's see if I can find one. All right, so this is like the Buffalo check. I was looking at this one and then also this plaid. We're gonna do actually craft night with our friends one night, so I'm really excited about that. So I told him I'd pick up the ribbon. But of course, you know, Sam's Club has like the most beautiful ribbon, really inexpensive. Well, you guys, I had luck. I got a planner at Office Max. So now I'm gonna go into Target, maybe find some fun stickers. Alrighty, so I found a day planner. I am so excited, you guys. I mean, I know it sounds like not a big deal, but I mean, we only have two months left of this year. I really wanted to start getting organized into the new year. So nothing like organizing your calendar on a dreary day. So that's what I'm gonna be doing tonight. And I found um, some little stickers. I like to put them for birthdays. That way the date pops up to me, out to me when I'm looking out that month ahead. So now I'm gonna run into Marshall's real quick and uh, see what maybe we can find. All right, you guys, I am back, and I thought I'd share with you some of the stuff that I picked up today. So, I love this bowl set. I feel like, you know, I just, plain old Tupperware is just boring. This is so pretty. So, the Melanie 10-piece uh, ten, ten bowl set, so it's one, two, three, four, five bowls with lids. So, I picked that up, and here is my planner. So pretty, and it actually starts off with, um, or what I like about it too is it has this little pocket in front, which is really nice. And then it actually starts out with um, October. So I can actually start using it now and just transferring everything into here for the new year. Just got some little stickers. I like to put these on just for birthdays and different events, just so those specific days just pop out to me when I'm looking at my calendar. These are my favorite markers that I love to use. So I just picked up a few more of those. And then this is a page marker, so I'm not sure. I'm gonna see how this thing works. And so I got that, what else? Oh, I got my uh, my ribbons, the two ribbons. Then I picked up one more Ray Dunn mug, and this one is uh, Some More Please. And I thought that was super cute. Um, I'm gonna have so much to share with you on this vlog. Okay, what else I wanna talk to you guys about? Oh yeah, at the end of the week on Saturday, Mark and I are gonna go to uh, the wineries and spend the night at Geneva on the lake, which we love. And then um, we have the gala event that night. So I went there last year, the last few years we've gone there, and so I'm gonna bring you guys along. Good morning, happy Tuesday. Actually watching the Housewives of the OC, getting ready to head out. Just got done ironing my shirt. And let me just turn this down a little bit. I get my nails done today. And um, then we're gonna go tonight. I'm taking, we're taking my mother-in-law and Allie because we all need new Christmas trees. So Mark's gonna drive us. We're all gonna be on a Christmas tree hunt. I'm not sure what's up with the hair. So yeah, that's what's going on today. It's a beautiful day, a little chilly, but sunny. So I'm gonna hurry up and take Archie out and I'll think I'm gonna head to bed, um, Bath and Body. I mean, because today they have the Marshmallow Fireside Candles for 10.95. So I'm gonna run there real quick and then head to my nail appointment. So not sure what color I'm gonna get yet today, but uh, I got this cute shirt on from Express, just my cello jeans and some, some boots. So, all right, let's head out. 
guys got my goodies at uh, Bath and Body. Got some coupons, 25% off, and a free body lotion and a free hand lotion. So I'm set with my marshmallow fireside. All right, so off to my nails now. Gosh, it's such a pretty day today. Hi guys, I thought I'd check in. I'm actually in line at Chick-fil-A. I am so hungry, so I'm gonna have just a couple chicken nuggets. When I'm really hungry and I want to not be too bad but semi-healthy, that's what I end up getting. So that's what I'm going to get right now is a couple chicken nuggets. So I got my nails done. It's a new color and it's called Vixen. It's really, really pretty. It's like a deep kind of purpley brown. I love it. It's really, really pretty. So I'm going to go do that. And, uh, and then I think I'm going to run into Hobby Lobby. Just check out their trees first before we head all the way out to at home. And uh, that way we don't do like, you know, have a wasted trip. So I'm going to go in there after I get my nuggets. And we're going to look around and see if there's maybe something there since it's pretty close to home. So we'll see. Alrighty, so I'm going to do a quick little haul of the things that I picked up today at this store. So at Hobby Lobby, love this, it's so cozy, this Buffalo Check Blankie. So 40% off, which you know, I love a good, good sale. Everything I got there today was 40% off, which is great. So I ended up getting this beautiful red and back black buffalo checked ribbon for our craft night with my friends and for a shimmy on me i can't pass up a wonderfully beautifully scented candle and this one is called green wreath i love the packaging and you guys it smells so good I'm like, I was gonna put it to like the camera. Can you smell it? <laughs> it smells so good. The girl, the cashier actually was smelling it. She goes, this smells great. I'm like, I know it's so good. All right, so then, of course, you know, I got the marshmallow fireside candles. And then I was able to get, I think, um, a warm vanilla sugar candle. I mean, lotion. I think maybe this was $6 or something like that. And then I got some, oh, I got some plugins. The refillables and that I got um, evening hearth. Oh my gosh, you guys, it smells so good. You gotta smell that scent. And then I got vanilla bean Noel for my car, and I got a um, a holder for it too. And oh, and a little mini lotion we got for free. And I got the stress relief. All right, so I got a couple little package things I want to share with you too. So let me go get the boxes. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to show you is from Too Faced. And it's a lippy. It's called Natural Nudes. Go figure, another nude. I can't remember if I saw someone try this or what, but I know that it looked really pretty on whoever it is I saw and I had to order it. So I don't know. What do you guys think? I can't even tell because I'm looking through the viewfinder. So Natural Nudes from Too Faced. Here it is. And then Lauren and I got um, the opportunity to uh, get some things through Grove Collaborative. That's going to be coming out to everyone else. So if you didn't watch our video this week, I'm going to share with you again what uh, we got in the box. Alrighty, so these are scents that are going to be coming out for the holiday season. And uh, so what we ended up getting is um, a glass dish soap bottle. Look at how pretty. This is the box. And here is the glass bottle dispenser. I love it has this rubber so it won't slide. And look at the beautiful flowers on it. It's so pretty. So this one is for the dish soap. And then here is the other one here. And this is the uh, box for the hand soap bottle. And here is the hand soap bottle. Look at how pretty these, these are. Can you imagine how gorgeous this is gonna look on my sink? And of course, you need something to put in it. And the scent is, this is the gel hand soap, pomegranate and red currant. So this is, like I said, this is the gel hand soap. And then here is the fillable packet, the gel dish soap. So, let's smell this stuff. Oh gosh, that smells so good. 
Oh my goodness, you guys. I cannot wait to start using these. I cannot wait. So um, I think I'm gonna start using them now because you know, why not? Uh, because I'm sure we'll be able to order these once they come out to everybody, but we got the VIP access because we are Grove Collaborative Girls. So, okay, I wanted to show you these goodies today. I'm gonna go get all the stuff put away and get ready to go get some Christmas trees. So I'm really excited. Yes, it is. We're gonna go find a tree, girls. <laughs> lobby out in this area and see if we have any luck. All right, we've got luck. We've got three trees. Believe it or not, at Home Depot, you guys. <laughs> Isn't it crazy? I really love my tree, so I'll show you guys. Um, I debated between the nine foot and the seven point, seven and a half foot, but Mark thinks the seven and a half foot will fit better in the area, so let me show you. everyone good morning happy Wednesday um, so I had my workout this morning went home chatted with little orchid on the phone for a while planning our video for tomorrow and uh, now I'm off to go get my hair colored I do go every three weeks you guys I have to go to my roots and um, so yeah and then we were gonna film today we decided to wait till tomorrow I cannot wait to share these two videos with you guys I think you're gonna the one is well just fun for us but the other one I think you're gonna really really like and I I love it so um, so yeah we're excited about that and that's really about it nothing too thrilling today I'm gonna go to the store pick up a few things for tomorrow's video foodie things and um, Oh, I've got some things that, that I got yesterday in the mail. I can't wait to show you. Well, actually, one thing. So, um, I'm really pumped about I got my first ever advent calendar. Honest to God, I would really love to do Vlogmas. I just don't know if Lauren would be into it. Not to mention, I do the editing. So, I don't know how we would do that. But, I don't know. If you guys have some kind of an interest in a Vlogmas, let me know. I did buy an advent calendar. So, I'm excited about that. So, all right, well, I'm actually at Dunkin' Donuts. I'm gonna grab a coffee here to take to my hair appointment, and I'll check in after. I got my hair all done. Went to the grocery store, so check mark those off the list today. I'm at a red light, so that's why I'm talking to you guys real quick. Now I'm gonna run to Ulta. I've got that 20% off, and it's off of everything prestige and all. So, I was talking, a little texting with Kristen321, Kristen Game, Tika, Lauren and I trying to figure out, and Melissa Prada, what we're gonna use with our 20%. And, I just don't know what to get, but I know there's got to be something I need. So, heading to Alta, and then I'm going to go home and make some lunch because I am really hungry. Okay, so like I talked about a little earlier, um, I got my first ever advent calendar, and I'm so pumped. So, I'm going to link where I got it, and this is, I think, a great value. So, here is my first advent calendar, and let me open this baby up. It's huge. <laughs> All right, we'll try to lift it without breaking anything open. So here it is, the advent calendar. So I can't wait, you guys, to uh, to use this starting December 1st. Like I mentioned earlier, if you guys are interested in some form of a type of a Vlogmas, I'm not sure how we're gonna do this, but I'm gonna talk to Lauren. I would really like to do it. I love watching Vlogmas videos, so why not us do it? So if you guys would be interested, just let me know in the description section, okay? So, all right, I got something else coming in today's mail that I know you guys are gonna really like. So um, it should be here any minute now when the postman gets here, so I can't wait. All right, guys, I feel like Christmas just uh, arrived today. <laughs> so UPS um, pulled in, the US postman just pulled in. So let me show you, I'm, I'm excited. first of all, okay. <laughs> So excited about this you guys probably already know well i got my sephora vib woohoo october 26th through the 29th and then the next set of dates are november 2nd through 5th so 
yeah there are some things i definitely need from sephora 20 percent off love it all right so um i was watching the other day i just i watched so many youtube videos and I was just like sitting there watching stuff and I'm like, who else can I watch right now? So I haven't watched in a long time. Thought I'd just catch up and see what was going on with him was that Christopher Allen. And he was talking about this candle. You know me, as soon as he talked about this candle, I'm like, oh my gosh, what is it? Anything different, I wanna know. You guys, if you really want a different kind of a gift that's boxed so beautifully and just of a candle company like I have never heard of because I never heard from them. And the company is called, hold on. So the company is called um, Other Land. This candle is so beautiful and I can't wait to smell it. So I'm gonna smell it with you guys. Well, at least it looked beautiful from what I can say from when I watched this video. But also what just came was my mono box um, from iShop Jewelry. Um, remember I showed you guys the wraps? <clears throat> so this is my next box. The reason why I'm getting them so close together is because I signed up late in the month last month. That's why I got September's right, I mean at the end of the month. And now I just got October. So I'm going to put it all on. I'm going to show you guys. I'm so pumped. Alrighty. So my mono box. This was the October mono box. Look at you guys. It's an apron with my monogram. Perfect because I'm actually making dinner right now. Which I'm going to share with you guys here in a minute. So oh my gosh. I just love it. You know who doesn't love a cute apron. I always used to love that Tika always had the cutest aprons on when she did stuff. And I'm like, I want a cute apron with my monogram. So, okay, so looks funny. I got my workout clothes still on. Um, but so yeah, here is my apron. Look at how cute you guys. It has a little bow. There's actually, let me see, is there pockets or no? I don't think so. No. No pockets. Oh, maybe there is a no, no, no pockets. But okay, so here is my my apron here so i love my apron and then what came with the apron was um these mitts for stuff in the oven which i already did put something in the oven so look how cute these mitts are and this is like a warmer how cool is this oh my gosh i love the black and white check <laughs> all right so then you can get if you choose a swag bag in with the uh, monthly subscription with i love jewelry so look what i got okay so it's this cute comfy sweatshirt but guess what my monogram is right here how cute is this it's so nice and soft something to lounge around in the back is just a little bit longer than the front perfect to cover your butt so i'm going to be putting this on a little bit later or maybe i'll wear it tomorrow yeah okay so i'm so pumped all right so let me show you this candle now okay so here's the candle. This is the company Other Land. So look at this box. I took it out of the big box, so we're gonna look at this together. It lifts like this. Okay, and then here's a lid. Hold on, a little hard to do. A lid. Wow, look at how gorgeous this candle is. And, oh, it comes with matches, box matches, which is so nice, so let's pull this out. <laughs> Okay, here it is. So here's the candle. How pretty. Gorgeous lid, like a plaid looking lid. Okay, so you can choose different scents. This is the one I chose. And I can't remember the scent, what it is actually, but I'll have to list it below. Oh my gosh, that smells fantastic. It almost smells, oh my gosh, it's like all my favorite scents. It's like, a, it smells like it could be a, a very classy fragrance, like a perfume. Oh my gosh, you guys, this smells awesome. I can't wait to light this. I think I'm gonna do more of this like in the living room or bedroom. Um, this will be a great gift. All right, I've talked long enough. I need to get dinner going, so I'll share with you what I'm making for dinner. All right, you guys, so what I did is I got a um, spaghetti squash and just cut it in half, took the seeds out, put a little olive oil in it, put skin side up in the oven for 45 minutes at 375, and then over here I just went ahead and you know, just how you just get a fork and make like little spaghetti from it. And so then over here, I have sauteed, or actually I cooked some um, grass-fed ground beef a pound, drained it. Now inside of my pan here, oh, with my Chrissy Teigen utensils, by the way, which I'm loving. I've got some garlic, onion, pepper, and some mushrooms. I'm just gonna saute for a few minutes. 
And then I'm going to add um, some diced, organic diced tomatoes and some sauce, which I dropped this on the floor. Actually, thank God I dropped it before I opened it. Um, basil, oregano, and some salt and pepper, fresh parsley, and let this cook for a little bit, add the meat back in, and then serve it over my spaghetti squash. That's what's dinner for dinner tonight. So good. I got water running over there for my dishes. So let's see. Wow. That is so delicious. We don't even need pasta. Trust me, the spaghetti squash is fantastic. Let me show you it. All done. I'm going to add some fresh Pecorino Romano cheese. I did add a little bit of crushed red pepper because I like a little bit of a kick of a heat, a little heat. But other than that, you guys, this is a winner. Enjoy with a glass of wine. Well, hi, everybody. It is actually Thursday, 5-11. <laughs> Lauren was here today. We filmed all day today, and then I did a lot of editing. And because uh, we normally film like on Tuesdays. So it gives me some time to edit. So because it's Thursday and tomorrow's the weekend, I'm trying to get everything done today. So Mark and I are going to head out. We were going to go to the club. Uh, Mike and Kim just called, and now they want to do something with us. So we're going to go somewhere else. Uh, so I just cut this off-the-shoulder shirt that I actually got last year from Nordstrom. Some black dress pants and some boot shoes. And I'm going to wear my new wrap from I Love Jewelry, which I showed you guys in my with my uh, monogram in my last vlog. So... All right, well, I'm going to get the little one here, put, uh, you know, take him out before we head out. And uh, um, it's so dark in this place that we're going. That's the only thing I hate about it. But I'll try to pull up the camera and maybe share what we're having to eat and uh, anything exciting or not. But, uh, but anyway, I just want to check in and say hi. And hopefully uh, I'll check in with you guys when we get to the restaurant. Guys, we're out to eat, and I have got an avocado and a crab salad, a little beano, some halibut. This thing looks so delicious. This is spice tonight. Hi, guys! Happy Friday! Yeah, it's Friday. So I'm um, just trying to get some lighting in here a little bit. <laughs> it's in the afternoon. I have been cleaning all day today. So if you guys watched my clean with me video from last week, that's basically what I did all day today. And finally showered. Um, we're going to go over Gary and Jody's here um, in a couple hours. And we're going to go tonight to go see A Star is Born. I am so excited to see that movie. I saw it a long, long time ago. I hear Lady Gaga is just phenomenal in this movie, so I cannot wait. And um, so, yeah, we're going to go to Gary and Jody's first and then go to the movies. And uh, so, that's it. I've been cleaning all day today. I was on the phone with Tika. Her and I were talking about what outfits we're going to take on our girls' trip, which is next week. I'm so excited to spend time with these girls. I cannot wait. So, Lauren and I ordered Colin Ray shirts, and they did come, so I'll show you that. And, um, yeah, just trying to decide what we're going to pack. So... Um, so I've got all the laundry done. I'm going to keep getting all the laundry continually done. So it's, I got, you know, all my stuff ready to roll for the trip for packing. And, uh, I'm going to try to think of what else. So excited for tomorrow. I got my dress ready. I got to pick out the shoes yet. And then of course, tomorrow morning, we're going to get up, head to the wineries. And we got that gala event, gala event tomorrow night. I love this place. I love these wineries. I love this lodge. It's so pretty, you guys. So I can't wait again to bring you guys along because I did last year. And um, that's about it, really. So I don't know. <laughs> so I'll probably check in with you guys when we get over Gary and Jody's and, um, and just uh, whatever else we've got going on uh, tonight. All right, guys, we're off to Gary and Jody's and uh, got one of my wraps on from, where did I get this one from? Box of Style. Archie knows we're leaving, so we'll see you over there. All right, you guys, we're here at the movie theater to see a star is born. You see me? Everybody. So cool. 
I even got my vino. I can't wait to see this movie. I'm so excited. All right, good morning, guys. Happy Saturday. I'm all dressed up, ready to head out to the wineries, all packed up. It's going to be a little bit of a rainy day once we get there, but that's okay. We're excited and looking forward to it. So I uh, can't wait to bring you guys along. Lost again, going back around Dreaming of a time when I get things right Lost in the shadows of a million stars Shouldn't they enlighten my near and far? Shouldn't they at all just tell me where you are? Send a prayer if I'm out of Baby, I'm stuck with a halfway heart 
event i've got this red dress on you guys have seen it before shoes on from actually that i wore, wore at morgan and tony's wedding just some little sparkly earrings so um took a quick little nap it hailed it was so bad out it, the, the sky got black as black so uh and then it hailed and a storm went through so i'm really happy that we were in here when all that happened so i'm going to use my phone to probably film down there just because it's a an event and I really don't want to be pulling out my camera, but I'll try to film as much as I can. So I'm going to try to go to the big mirror just to show you my outfit. So let's head over here. I'm going to flip this phone around. And so here it is. And the shoes I wore for Morgan and Tony's outfit. Outfit for their wedding. So here we are. It's actually a very comfortable dress. It's always so cold in there. That's why I wanted to make sure that I had long sleeves. So anyway, like I said, I got a nice little quick nap and uh, we're ready to go. So I'm gonna meet Mark downstairs. He headed downstairs so I could film real quick. And uh, so I'll see you guys when we get down there. $10. Last year, someone paid $10 and took $1,700 home. $1,700 last year. Good morning, you guys. Happy Sunday. Well, this is the lodge here. It's so beautiful where we stayed last night. We had the worst weather, and the hotel lost electricity. It was crazy, um, but pretty eventful. This place is so pretty, though. All right, guys. Windy morning but beautiful place. Heading back home, still dark skies, but really, really pretty. I'm gonna show you around here. You can ride bikes and stuff here. Just so gorgeous. So heading back home. See you guys when we get there. Well, we are back home. It literally went from like the fall season to winter, guys. So let me show you. Um, what i got from the um like the auctions and stuff like that you know you play tickets the chinese auction so this is what i want is a hurricane from last night which i'm so excited about because you guys know much i love hurricanes oh by the way look at this i got this the other day i love this so much i cannot wait to decorate it for the holidays so i wanted to show you this and then of course this is i bought that Two tiered stand, but this Archie, no, no, no. This is what I won last night. And they came also with these cute little pumpkin candles. Look how cute these are. So, so cute. Mark's doing work, obviously. Um, this morning, or we just got home, now he's already in work mode. So this is all the stuff in the kitchen table here. And uh, so it looks like a total uh, fall, fall shop here on my bar area but this isn't normally always on here but it actually looks really, looks really pretty and festive so okay so i wanted to show those things to you guys and we're gonna go actually i'm gonna go with aunt missy uncle jim and cousin jimmy and my mother-in-law to um saint anthony's italian it's an it's a like a spaghetti dinner tonight <laughs> mark has to work so i'm gonna bring home some spaghetti and meatballs for him and I think I'm just gonna have meatballs and salad. So that's what we're gonna do this afternoon. Stop it up at Petiti's to see all their gorgeous Christmas decor. Oh my gosh, you guys.
funny because we were laughing it's because it's like where all the Italians go for a delicious Italian dinner. It was it was so good. So so good. Uh, so now I'm just home. I'm going to edit this vlog and get this ready to go because you know we have a really busy week. So I want to start getting stuff organized for our trip to um, Wisconsin. And I just cannot wait to see all the girls. So I wanted to end this like I do all my vlogs. And I'm not going to do any Karen's laws just because I'm running out of time here today. But I am changing our hashtag living fully to actually hashtag living in bliss. Because when I saw that somewhere i'm like that is just so me i love that so much so sort of also means almost the same as living fully but i love the living in bliss so this week's question is what is the one thing that you do to help you to keep living in bliss every day so share that with me and uh you know mine is just trying to keep a positive attitude to me that helps me live in bliss is just keep a positive attitude so Hey, you guys, thank you so much for coming along for me on this week's vlog. And uh, I just really hope you enjoyed it. I had a great week. It was so much fun. And I cannot wait to see you guys in two weeks. So, as always, thank you so much for watching, subscribing, hit that bell to be notified each time we upload a video. And I'll see you next time. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.